DIY, and this is also a no sewing DIY. It's more of an art to deck project. Here I have a pair of gold heels, and here I have a pair with blue platforms. So if you'd like to learn how to change the color of your shoes, stay tuned! I'm going to start with my brown shoe. I'm just going to begin taping my shoe wherever I don't want it to be spray painted. <laughs> I finished taping the general sides of the shoe. Remember to tuck in the tape into the seam of the shoes as much as you can. Next, you need to tape the sole. If you don't want to spray paint the sole, you need to tape that. And what I'm also going to do is, because these are strappy sandals and I don't want to have to tape every single strap, I'm going to take some scrap paper and build myself a little shoe fortress. I have finally finished taping all of it. So as you can see, I didn't tape the bottom of the sole since the shoe is going to be sitting flat on the ground and I won't get any spray paint on it but I'm only spray painting this part of the black shoes and then for these shoes I'm spray painting both the heel and the platform <laughs> dry and I think it's ready to unveil the final product. Um, I let them dry for not as long as it was recommended but I'm just so excited that I really need to start peeling this tape off. So let's begin. So I'm done peeling it off. This is my hunk of garbage. Set that aside. The heels turned out super cool. I was a little bit messy with the application of the spray paint. Some really good advice is to go lightly on the spray paint. I kind of went a little crazy and was just like... Ooh. Some of it dripped down onto the base of the heel where the black areas are. If you can see it looks a little sloppy. But that's okay. I'm just going to go over it with go over it with some acrylic paint. I think this turned out really cool. The gold is a little darker than I expected. I think that adds subtlety to the heel. Here is my gold one. Pretty smooth application. Just have to clean up all the messy bits. So, now onto the black ones. The black heels turned out a lot nicer than my brown ones, and I, I know that I wanted to see the black ones more because I. I really enjoyed the color contrast between them. Now the underside is a mess like nobody's business, but that's okay. You won't really see the underside of it. This is the final product of my black heels. I love them. Now because of the wooden aspect of the heel, it's more like a finished wood. I would recommend sanding the heels before applying anything to it because when I was spray painting it, some of the spray paint was running a little. This is the final product. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I remember cutting up some of my mom's clothing, getting into a lot of shit from it. 